here it comes from the Bob Barker Studios in CBS City, Hollywood. Television's most exciting show full of fantastic prizes. It's time for The Price is Right. And now, here's your host, the star of The Price is Right, Brandon Scruggs. Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy B back with you once again for another edition of The Price is Right 2010 right here at MBG Productions. Glad you could join me here once again. Well, we kicked off the second series playthrough of this game. We did fairly well the first time around. We unlocked four of the pricing games, including the classic the Showcase Showdown, Contestants Row, which we usually get in the first go around. We also managed to pick up Hole in One and Plinko for a good starting end. Well, we got four of them unlocked. We've got 28 more to go. And we're going to see how we do as we jump into this round of The Price is Right, part of the 2010 Saturdays here on the channel. So if you guys are ready, I'm ready. Let's play some Price is Right. Here it comes. Your goal is to win as much money and fabulous prizes as you can before getting three strikes. Welcome to Contestants Row. Here is the item up for bids. I see what we're playing for first. Stereo today. karaoke system. Ah! Coco Pro Sonic That's Station, an all in one surround sound tower that plays MP3s, DVDs, CDs, and karaoke. The sleek design makes it a stylish addition to any room with an unbelievable sound from Coco Pro. Let's start the bidding. All right, that's like 800, 850. It says 1450. Diane says 520. Jed says 18. What is your bid? I'm going for my initial bid, seven fifty. The actual retail price is one thousand dollars. Come up on stage. There we go. I will take it. And we start off this run with a thousand dollar win. A good start. Let's see what our first pricing game of the day is going to be. You're going to play checkout for a chance to win $7,500. Ah, I like the checkout. To win the prize, you must guess the price of each of the four items. If the total of your guesses is within $2, high or low of the total actual retail price, you win the prize. Let's see what you'll bid on. All right, let's check it out. Degree Women Ultra Clear Pure Rain. Dare to make a statement in black. Tell me what you think is the price of this item. I believe this one's around, I want to say like $4. So I'll lowball it and say about tree fitty. Dove Intense Damage Therapy Shampoo and Conditioner, 12 ounce. Reduces hair breakage and split ends. And now, give me a price for this item. Um, the shampoo runs about $5. I'm going to give it $4 on this one. I can't believe it's not butter or original soft spread. 70% less saturated fat than butter and no trans fat. With its fresh butter taste, I can't believe it's not butter is the smart choice. 8 grams fat, 2 grams saturated fat per serving. Now this item. Uh, the butter is usually like $1.75. Nor pesticides Alfredo. Every meal is an opportunity. Last but not least, what is this item worth? And the pesticides I know usually sells for like a dollar thirty-nine. So my total is this is your total. 1064. Let's see what the items are worth. I got to be with an eight. This item is worth twelve sixty-four. Three ninety-nine. This one is worth shampoo seven fifty-two. Wow! How about I'm this one? In trouble. Two forty-nine. Let's see the value of this item. The shampoo was a way more difference expensive. of too bad. Four dollars eighty-one. You lost so. the game. <laughs> had I put a, had I put another three dollars on the shampoo, I'd have been all right. It's time for the showcase showdown. You get two spins. Take your spin. All right, time for the showcase showdown, as you know. Got to get as close to a can in one dollar in a combination of one spin or two spins. Get a thousand dollars and get a bonus spin if I can get to a dollar. 
And I'm going to start with a 10. Tie. So Brisbane Would you now. like to spin again? All right. Looking for the magical number 90 here on the second spin. And we're not getting 90. I won't get a dollar. 75 would be okay. But it's going to be 55. So 65 cents 65. total is what we've got. Stand next to and the wheel. And we're going to see if I can beat that 65 as William takes a spin. Again, thank you for spending part of your day here with me, MVG Productions. Very glad to appreciate you guys here with us. And we'll just start with a nickel on this one. Five. Take your second spin. Yeah, starting off this series here for uh, on Saturdays here, it's, it's been a lot of fun, and I'm going to enjoy playing through it throughout the year. So I was looking forward to these uh, combination pack of games as you will. Is he going to get another nickel? Wow, back to back nickels. Ten. That's rough. Your total is less That's, than the leader. That's officially Sorry, the worst you can time. do, like score wise, with 10 cents. Jed's going to spin. He's going to have to beat 65. He might actually tie it. Nope, he's going to need another spin. He's going to start with a dime. 10. Take your second spin. And second spin out here. And Jed is looking like he's going to pick himself up something. Man, it's not going to be enough. 35. 45. So a 65 Your total cents. is less than the leader. I Sorry, better luck next time. I managed to steal a victory, and I'm going to the showcase. All right, let's go see if we can win some decent prizes this time around. Time for the showcase podiums. Welcome to the showcase. The showcase visits the dock at Port of Price, where a new shipment of prizes is just being delivered. And we can see that the first prize being shipped in is this comfy new sofa. Okay. Sackett's Harbor from the Wrangler Home Collection by Flex Steel redefines the standards of comfort. Carefully crafted, the inviting fabric completes this sofa that embraces every part of your life from Flex Steel. The next prize our ship is bringing us is this new bathtub. Light yet right. durable, this Virginia freestanding clawfoot soaking bath from Acroline features a smooth acrylic exterior. Its stiletto high heel shape is a modern version of yesteryear's bathing style from Acroline. Finally, our ship unloads a prize that always provides lots of fun, these two new off-road motorcycles. Very nice. A pair of Honda CRF 250X off-road motorcycles, lightweight and nimble with an electric starter and a 250cc engine. And this showcase where we did a little dock watching can be yours if the price is right. That's a nice showcase, but not actually one I don't want for it. You're the top winner. Will you bid on this showcase or pass it to the other player? I'm totally going to pass this one. How much do you think your showcase is worth? Dan takes her showcase with 11721 Your showcase contains prizes revealed as we meet Wendy, the workout warrior. And Wendy is so into exercise, she works it into her everyday routine. For instance, if she's getting ready to bake, she lifts bags of flour before using her new range. Cook different foods at different okay, temperatures with a stainless steel freestanding gas range that contains two self-cleaning ovens. And she makes it a point to practice what she calls the morning stretch so she won't pull anything when she wakes up in the morning and gets out of her new poster bed. Make all your dreams come true with this elegant Chateau Frontenac queen poster bed from Ashley Furniture. Coated with a beautiful multi-step brown cherry finish and adorned with hand-carved detailing from the Ashley Companies. And Wendy is so into exercise that the push-ups in her workout routine are inspired by the precision of her new high-low trailer. Well, the trailer company's tow light telescoping travel trailer. This versatile 17 foot trailer lowers and raises in seconds. It features an overhead bunk, air conditioning, and 12 foot awning. Your showcase, in which we see that even Wendy cheats a little bit, can be yours if the price is right. All right, so new range, our new stove, uh, a new. How much do you think your showcase is worth? Four poster bit and the new um, tent trailer. Okay. So, trailer's at least 11 grand, maybe 12. The stove's another 1,500, and the bed's probably another five. So, 18.5 is not completely out of the question. Mm -hmm. 
I'll go 18 550. Let's see how we do. Your Giants showcase is worth price is 20,574 for, for a difference, a difference of, of 9 eight, uh, 88 53. Your showcase, showcase is worth 23,487 for a difference, difference of, of 4937. I have won the you showcase. You won the showcase. Finally. After a horrible start the first time through. You've set a new high score. I got a Congratulations. showcase win here. 23,487. Or you do it for 24,487. You've earned a new achievement. And I've unlocked the showcase. So, officially at one game down on, on the unlock list today. Let's get back to Contestants Row. Play another one. Welcome round. to Contestants Row. The, here is the item up for bids. It's a fun trampoline. Okay. Thanks safety first with this new stage bounce trampoline and enclosure system from Jump Sport, a leader in backyard safety and innovation. Includes the popular ProFlex basketball goal. Stay fit, have fun, and play safely with Jump Sport. Let's start the bidding. And now, as a man show tribute, I present it's to you. It's your turn to bid. Girl jumping on trampoline. If you've seen the man show, that, that was for you guys. All right, um, trampoline. So, with the netting and stuff, it can't be no more than 800. So I'm gonna say 800. Ollie says 604. Moana. 801. The actual retail really? price is 8. Oh my! You lose. Wow! You are. This is a your first strike. Don't worry, computer, you still have two to real. go. I was off by eight bucks, and you had to one up me. I hate that. You're going so to play much. cliffhangers for a chance to win thirty thousand dollars. All right, see if we can save Yodely guy. You have to guess the actual retail price of each item. For every dollar you miss, high or low, the hiker takes one step up the mountain. If he goes too far, he falls off the mountain, and you lose. If he stays on the path, you win. Translation: Let's see what Do you'll not bid on. kill Hans. This Hans will be very Your mad. first bid is for this item. This toaster cooks four slices of bread or two sliced up bagels at the same time. Tell me what you think is the price of this item. Okay, four slice toaster, adjustable settings, cannot be more than $25. Am I right? All right, Hans, Let's see how many steps he'll take. On the way. Um, Hans, you can stop at any time now, buddy. Hans? Seriously? How expensive is this toaster? Are you kidding me? Really? The hiker's still on the path. Let's return to the items. That's a $50 Your toaster. Your next item is... That you won't awesome. miss any important phone calls with this 30-minute digital answering machine. And now, give me a price for this item. Wow, so I have to get these last two dead on. Not happening. Sorry, Hans. I'm, I tried to save you, but it's not happening. $20. He's almost off the mountain. Good luck. The hiker fell off the mountain. I'm sorry, you don't win anything. $50 for a slice toaster. You're paying too much for that. It's time I'm sorry. for the showcase. It's time to spin the wheel. Anyway, wheel time again. I'm genuinely annoyed and upset about that, folks. Like, like I let me know in the comment section. Even back in 2010, with a four-slice toasting option, there is 90. no way. Would, would you pay, like to spin again? You would pay fifty dollars. Stand next for to the wheel. Freaking four-slice toaster. I'm sorry. Don't care who it's made by. You're overpaying if you do. I mean, you can get some nice ones at reasonable prices at your local retailers between fifteen and twenty dollars today. So I'm like, why would you pay fifty dollars for a toaster then? That's just fifteen. Re take your second spin. I'm sorry. All right, I'm gonna get off. I'm gonna get off the toaster thing now. But it, but it genuinely does irk me. Anyway, Jerry and his second spin is going to pull off ninety. You got over one dollar. Sorry. Better luck next time. So yeah, eyes up. 90 spins, not 90 spins, wow. I might need to get some caffeine after this one, folks. But it's been a while. It's been a long day for me but when I'm recording this one, but you know. Um, getting started here. 65, 65. cents for Ollie so Take far. Take your second spin. He's going to need to pick up at least 25 to 35. 
puts him in the showcase, and makes me upset. We shall see what happens as we come to look at you with the 30 cents. 95. Wow. Bravo. I'm, I'm genuinely not even mad about the fact that that happened, but you, you stole it, and that's what happened. 95 cents sends me back to Contestants Row to try to get one up again. Welcome by to Contestants Row. Let's see what the Here item is the item up, up for bids. Imagine uh, relaxing peacefully as the serenity of this gently cascading freestanding waterfall from Napoleon creates a soothing ambiance, a living work of art for your home from Napoleon. Let's start the bidding. I actually genuinely wanted one of those as a kid. Um, standing waterfall. What is your bid? I, my original thought was like around a thousand, but I'm going to say 900. This, that's just what number popped in my head. The actual retail price is? Thousand dollars. Come up on stage. Wow. I should just go with my gut instinct more often to say, because it would go with the even amount. But hey, two thousand dollar prizes. I could have had two perfect bids today. It's just not happening yet. But I did get contestants throw there. This is your now chance to play. It's in the bag for sixteen thousand dollars of cash. Let's play. It's in the bag. Yep, we know Let's this game. Let's start by showing you the items you'll be bidding on today. All right, so what are we bidding for? Please Our be, first please item be is Dove Daily Moisture Shampoo, 12 ounce, reduces static and flyaways and protects against moisture loss. Okay. Next item. Next up is. I can't believe it's not butter cooking and baking sticks. Bakes and tastes like butter with 50% less saturated fat than butter and no trans fat. They're delicious for spreading too. Contains 11 grams of fat, 3.5 grams saturated fat, 0 grams trans fat per serving. All right, next Your up. next item is... Nor Rice Sides Chicken Rice. Every meal is an opportunity. I don't know how much that one costs. The final item you'll bid on is Lipton Green Tea Citrus 40 Count. Drink better, live better. Lipton Tea can do that. All right, it's always the last one that always gives me like the most trouble. You have four items and five price tags. Put a price tag on each item. If you match all four items with the correct tags, you win sixteen thousand dollars. Yep. Here's to hopefully winning. $16, Tell me what you think is the price of this item. All right, the shampoo, the Dove hair care, the white bottle version, that is, well, if the blue one is like 760 something, then I would say this one may be, let's go 399 And the price of this one? Uh, the, I can't believe it's not butter baking sticks are... I'd say that's two. Yeah, about two forty-nine. Could wait. Um. Yeah, two forty-nine. And now, give me a price for this the item. Rice sides is a dollar forty-five. What is the price of this last and item? And the green tea for a forty-count package. I'm gonna go three seventy. No. Yeah, three seventy-six. We'll go with it. For two thousand dollars, is this the correct price? No, sorry. Wow. Better luck next time. All right, shampoo is a little cheaper. Three dollars and seventy-six cents. All right. So don't even get to it's worry time about the for rest the showcase of them. showdown. It's your turn to spin the wheel. Let's get back to the wheel. Not not a great day so far here on this episode. We've only unlocked one price in game. And that was the showcase, just because we managed to get there. And maybe a dollar? No, 15 cents. 15. Would you like to spin again? Yes, I would, please. Spinning again. Fifteen cents in the first spin. There goes the eighty-five for the dollar, and I'm gonna finish with twenty-five, 25 cents. Stand next to the wheel. So proud of my twenty-five cent win. It will not. It will not survive these spins, folks. I, I guarantee this one. So. And there is the win. Sixty-five already beat. Sixty-five. Okay. 
Not what I wanted to see, but it's what happens. So 65 cents again sends me back to Contestants Row for another chance to bid at a prize. Welcome to Contestants Row. Here is the item up for bids. It's a charming children's playhouse. Develop and encourage your child's imagination with this easy-to-assemble Western Red Cedar Playhouse from Cedar Shed. It's sure to get the kids out of the house and into their own space from Cedar Shed Industry. Okay. Let's see who bids the closest without going over. Let's see. The Playhouse is at least 1500 that's what I'm thinking. What is your bid? Now watch me get one up again. I'm gonna go 1450. And Brad, 1730. The actual retail price is 1639. Okay. I did not get one up. The computer was actually being relatively nice to me. All right, 1639. You set a new high score. To... Congratulations. I met that's the most expensive prize I've won in contestants row so far. Added to what I've got, 27,176 on this run. And we're playing a new pricing game. Let's see what you'll be playing for. It's a new car. Hey! The 2009 Ford Mustang V6 Coupe Deluxe comes with standard equipment plus five-speed automatic transmission, navigation system, trip tunes, advanced iPod audio connection, all-weather floor mats, and paint protection. It's the Ford Mustang. All right, what game are we playing for it? Oh, three strikes. You can win it playing okay. three strikes. Your goal is to find the correct price of the car before you collect three strikes. We'll start by giving you the first number for free. Okay. So let's see that first number. It is a two. We're going to put a let's five, Let's put the chips a nine, in the bag. A four, an eight, and a strike. Token let's see what chip bag. is going to come up. All right. As long as it's not strikes, I'm good. You've drawn an eight. Place the number on the board. All right. Ford Mustang from 10 years ago at this point. Um, I don't think they were 28,000 yet, so I'm going to go third number eight. Sorry, it doesn't go there. Let's put it back in the bag. All right. Just remember where everything else goes and we'll be okay. Let's see what chip is going to come up. Mix them up and draw. You've drawn a four. All right. It's the second. Where do you think this number belongs? I think it was a $24,000. Second number's four. Great. Let's discard the chip. There we go. Good start so far. Draw a chip from the bag. All right, and pull. You've drawn an eight. Oh, the eight again. Where do you think this number belongs? Is the third number eight. You guessed wrong. We'll put the okay. chip back in the bag. All right, I should just... Draw a chip wow. from the bag. This is me playing the game and not paying any attention to where I've called that. I'm pretty sure I just said the third number's not eight. Wasted opportunity there. You've drawn a nine. All right, it's the third Place number Place the number nine. on the board. Sorry, it doesn't go there. Okay. Let's put it back in the I bag. I know what number goes in the third spot. I just have to find Let's it. Let's see what chip is going to come up. Let's shuffle and go. Uh-oh, your first strike. Two more and you lose. All right, we don't want that. So the strike goes back Let's in there. Let's see what chip is going to come up. And... You've drawn an eight. All right. It's not Where the third number. Where do you think this number. number belongs? I know some of you already yelled at me in the comments at least once by now, but it's okay. Last number eight. You guessed wrong. We'll put the okay. chip back in the bag. I now know where all the numbers go. It's just a matter of finding them. Draw a chip from the bag. No strikes, please. Give me a number. You've drawn an eight. Fourth number is Place eight. Place the number on. Great. Let's discard the chip. I'm not going to even let him finish. Like, Just put it in there. Let's see what chip is going to all come right, up. Come on. Number. Your second strike. Be uh, careful. One more and you're out. All right. I just need numbers. Draw a chip from the bag. Come on. Good number. Good number. I'm sorry. This is your third uh, strike. Game's I had over. a chance to win it. It just didn't happen, but unfortunately. It's time for the Showcase Showdown. It's All time right. to spin the wheel. Spinning the wheel. Sadly, no prizes to give away on that one. And another chance at the wheel, but maybe a dollar this time if it'll hurry. It's not going to hurry. I Five. Would you like to spin again? Yes, I would. Five cents in my first spin. And now my second spin will hopefully yield me more. And it's going to be 50. 45. Stand Just next enough. to the wheel. 
So 50 cents is what I got. So 50-50 chance of failure right here. Got to go north of 50, Charlie. Will he do it in one spin? Answers point two. No. That's 25. Take your second spin. All right. So again, he needs to get above 50 cents to beat me. And looks like this time around, we are going to have ourselves 45, and that's going to be 70. <laughs> 70 cents is going to send me back to contestants row again. And we're going to try our luck. Welcome we to contestants row. This next item up for bids. Here is the item up for bids. It's new binoculars. Okay. From Night Owl, a leader in night vision comes a fantastic set of binoculars that allow you to see things that go bump in the Those night. Those are from like stars and moonlight to complete darkness. See what's happening at night from Night Owl. Let's see who bids the closest without going over. Those are about 600, so I'm going to guess. Let's see, James bids 19. It's your turn to bid. Wow, you are seriously overbidding on some um, night vision goggles. $600. Don says 510. Luis says 680. This item's actual retail, retail price, price is 799. You lose. Okay. A little bit more expensive than I thought. You got your second strike. Be careful. One more, and it's game over. All right. If I miss. If I fail next time here on Contestants Row, that's my third strike, and unfortunately the end of this episode. But you can win it we're playing see if we can grocery play, game. Play grocery to game. win a grocery game, you must purchase between $20 and $21 worth of these items. Lipton Cup Size Tea Bags, 100 count. Drink better, live better. Lipton Tea can do that. Okay. Suave Professionals Color Care. Salon proven performance without the salon price tag. All right, trying to remember. Degree Women Ultra Clear Pure Powder. Dare to make a statement in black. All right. Dove Heat Defense I'm Therapy Mist. I'm the beauty products Helps shield your hair like, against okay. heat damage. There's no gimmies here. I can't believe it's not uh, butter. I can't Light believe sauce it's not butter. Fresh butter Again. tastes with 50% less fat and calories than butter and no trans fat. I can't believe it's not butter is the smart choice. 8 grams fat, 2 grams saturated fat per serving. Which item do you wish to purchase? You better believe this is the episode all about butter, apparently. Let's start with the Suave Ship. Actually, that might be the cheap one. Let's start with the hair care spray here. How many of them do you want? Let me have two. This item is worth... They're worth $3.76 a piece. Two of these two. totals. You're under twenty dollars. Seven fifty-two. Select another so item. Which item do you wish to purchase? Let me have two sticks of deodorant. How many of them do you want? This item is worth. The deodorant here is three ninety-nine. Two times of these two. totals for a grand total of fifteen. You're under twenty dollars. Select another item. Which item do you wish to purchase? I need to get between four fifty and five fifty worth of stuff. I have the tea the shampoo and I got the butter left all right let's go one how of the many of them do you want one shampoo this item is worth dollar 92 that was the one cheap of these one. totals for a grand total of your under twenty dollars select another item which item do you wish to purchase all right so I have 1742 so I need to get two fifty eight to three fifty eight and I think the butter will do it. How many of them do you want? One butter. This item is worth two forty-nine. One Are of you these totals. Serious. For a grand total of your under twenty dollars, select another item. Which item do you wish to purchase? All I have left is the tea. So. How many of them do I you want? One tea is less than a dollar eight cents, which I don't think it this is. This item is the worth. Tea is. 389. One of these totals for a grand total of sorry, you're over $21. You lose. The butter was off by 10 cents for the win. Uh, that is hard. It's time for the showcase showdown. Spin the wheel. Let's see if we can make it up here on the wheel. First spin out. And Maybe a dollar? 
Oh, look at that. One dollar. dollar. Here's your one thousand dollars. Thousand dollar bonus. Stand next to the wheel. I'll take that. So we've got ourselves some. We've got ourselves a win here on the big wheel, the showcase showdown. Let's see if we can get some bonus cash. The only way that somebody can beat me, they gotta tie me. So, might got one. Sh we might have at least one more shot. Twenty-five. At the, uh, the old. Uh, Take your second spin. Round. Second spin up. James got ten. Needs ninety. And second time around is not looking good for James. James gonna walk with. 30 cents. 45. Oh, 45, excuse me. Your total is less than the leader. Sorry, better luck next time. All right, nothing there. So done. Looking for the dollar to try to tie me. I still feel bad. It's like I do I do a lot of grocery shopping in my household. And I do very well, but I don't buy shampoo and stuff like every day. I have like certain brands that I get for myself. 65. And I know how, Take how your the second shopping spin. works, but it's like for me, like, the prices are a little off. But again, the fact I lost it, the butter let me down by 10 cents. Again. It's like, all right, butter's about 250 in this game. Especially the I can't believe it's not butter. No matter what it is, it's 250. You went over one dollar. And uh, sorry, it's over. better luck next time. And I'm gonna get a chance. Let's for that reset bonus the wheel spin. and try your bonus spin. It must go around once. And if it lands on a green or red space, you win a bonus cash prize. Yeah, here we go. Wheel has been reset for the big money. There it goes. Will we capture some bonus cash today? And it's going to be too much. Yeah, overshot it by just a couple spots. But hey, you didn't land on a bonus dollars. See you in the showcase. That's a win. And I'm going to get one more shot to pick up something nice as we head back to the showcase room. Here on the Price is Right 2010. Let's go. Welcome to the showcase. We're going to tell you if you're neurotic. Now, you know you're neurotic if you need to wear a hazmat suit when loading your new washer and dryer. With a cool blue a exterior, this washer and gas dryer offer advanced wash options for precise cleaning of all your fabrics. And you know you're neurotic if you find yourself arranging and cataloging your shoe collection on a new computer. This powerful computer comes with 4 gigs of memory and a 500 gigabyte hard drive, perfect for any home office. And you really know you're over the top neurotic if you find yourself sweeping the dust off the trail before off-roading in your brand new Jeep. Okay. The Jeep Wrangler X 4x4 comes with standard equipment plus air conditioning, the Jeep Wrangler. And we hope you're not too neurotic to bid because these prizes can be yours if the price is right. You're the top winner. Will you bid on this showcase or pass it to the other player? Oh, we're definitely bidding on this showcase. Um, what do you think is the value of your showcase? Okay, washing machine, dryer, probably f close to 3000 The computer, maybe another 1500 The Jeep is about twenty five, so a grand total of 28000 100 I said $150. That is my bid. We're going to show you some. We're going to skip Luis's showcase because we don't need to What watch do you think it. is the value of your showcase? He just needs to bid on it. He bids $19,640. let us see how well he did. Your Actual showcase retail is price worth. Luis's showcase $44,564. For a difference wow. of. Off by twenty four grand. Your showcase I is worth one fifty on mine. After retail price twenty three fifty five, and I'm over. And Luis, you picks lost up the, the showcase. Land. Better luck next time. All right, so nothing there. We go back to contestants. Welcome row. to contestants row. Another chance to the contestant with the bid closest to the actual going? retail price of. The Here Let's is the item up for bids. bids. It's a lovely bar set. This okay. lovely three-piece bar set is made of maple wood with maple veneers and solid maple bar stools that swivel and have a upholstered back. Let's see who bids the closest without going over. I'm thinking 1100 is my initial bid. So Ted says 1799. 
Patty says 3,300. Paul says 25. It's your turn to bid. I'm going to stick with my bid, $1,100. The actual retail price is? $24.99. You lose. <laughs> oh, no, this is your third strike. Sorry, but it's game over. Yep, that one's going to wrap it up for us here. But, hey, we did better this time around. 28,176, our new high score for the season so far. Uh, didn't do as well on the pricing games as I'd like to this time around, but we did unlock uh, one more. We picked up the showcase, at least, for the w showcase win. So we're up to five now. Uh, we'll see if we can do better and not have a $50 toaster next time we play Cliffhangers. But that's going to do it for us on this episode of The Price is Right 2010. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the series, check out the first time I played through this. See how well I did there. And then check out the 2010s playlist series here on the channel. And for more great games and fun stuff going on here, make sure you click the subscribe button down below and ring the bell. That way you never miss out on all the fun and games going down here at MVG Productions. And until we go bidding once again and I try to learn the better prices of stuff, I'm your host, Brandon Scuds, reminding you to help control the pet population, have your pets spayed or neutered, to help control the YouTube population, like, share, and subscribe to your favorite YouTube channels like mine. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see y'all next time.